So the team I was using before, this is this is where I was at before. I'm gonna I'm just gonna show this off and then we'll and then we'll talk. So I was running Polyrath, I was running Alolan Muck, and I was running Articuno. Muck and Arty. So this was like my go-to squad. I think that this squad is not gonna work anymore. Mostly because of well, I don't know that it won't not work. <laughs> Chrysalia leads are bad for it, but it's not like it's terrible. It's actually pretty good against all of that stuff. Which is to say, I might just run it for one and just see kind of like, let me get a sense for what the meta is. There's definitely some stuff I want to do. Like, I do have the S Cavalier that I'd like to do. Um, just don't know where to put it on the squad necessarily, aside from maybe in the Articuno spot. But I like, I like, I've always liked this team. So... I'm just going to try it, and we're going to get a sense for what the Ultra League meta is like, basically, and go from there. It's kind of where I'm at with it. It's like, why don't we actually see what Ultra League looks like before I commit to some sort of, some sort of change. Yeah, that's kind of how I feel with it. Oh, I have a Great League Poly? Okay. I won't use, I won't use the Great League Poly. How about that? That would be a mistake. How did I pick the wrong Polyrath? It just has such a it just has such a lovely uh round CP on it that I picked the right one. Good catch. Good catch. We can still win with a 1500 Polyrath, right? We could still win with a 1500 Polyrath. I need to resize I need to resize my phone a little bit too cuz it's it's not quite right. Okay. I think that's that's looking that's looking a little more correct I think all right yeah screw it let's let's get a feel for the ultra league meta first and then we'll go from there like crest leads are gonna be are bad for this team right now but if they switch into crest we've got we've got answers for it so let's go we're currently at 23 24 so I've got a lot of climbing to do <laughs> I've got a lot of climbing to do let's find out all right Articuno well this isn't really the matchup we want. The real question is whether or not they have Hurricane. Like, if they have Hurricane, this matchup is really bad. Unless we actually shield a Hurricane. So if they just keep charging, like... Like... I don't think they're at Hurricane yet. I don't think they are. Okay, it's Icy Wind. That's fine. I'd be very embarrassed if it had a hurricane. <laughs> but I can eat a couple Icy Winds here and not really worry much about this. Like, throw another Icy Wind at me. It's fine. What I'll do, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to switch to our own Articuno. Now that I feel like from an energy standpoint, we're pretty, uh, we're pretty neutral here. I think they got one up on us as a head start. What do you got? Oh, a Nololan Muck. Neat. Okay. I still feel pretty. I feel okay about this matchup. The Articuno is not like obviously our Polyrath isn't great against it, but it's not terrible. My guess is that what they're gonna do is potentially throw the uh, throw the poison move at me. Try and catch me off guard. Yeah, they're throwing the trash can at me. I was like, I know they're gonna throw it. That's the thing where I'm like, I just I. Players like to try and catch Articuno off guard, and I'm like, nah. Let's just shield that gunk shot. Let's go. The second one, I don't have to shield if they get it off. Alright, what you got? So, the RT is back. Let's see if they shield. Because <laughs> an Ancient Power will kill them. Or will come very close. There's the shield. So I can do the same, like, they could hit me with an Ancient Power, or I could just save the shield. I'm gonna save the shield. You know what, go for it. Ancient Power me. It doesn't kill me. Mostly because I already Icy Winded you once. And then I'm gonna throw our own Ancient Power because they don't have a shield. <laughs> and because they didn't debuff me, I think this will actually kill them. Or otherwise it would not. There we go. And then their last Pokemon is, oh, it's a Venusaur? Oh no. 
I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, friend. Um... Yeah, we're gonna get this Icy Wind off. Shinies do more damage? I mean, I don't think that's exactly what happened there, but... They don't need to see our last Pokémon's Alolan muck. I mean, they don't- they will, but they don't need to. They- they don't need to see it, right? We can just- we can just kill them before they see our last Pokémon's Alolan muck. Oh... You know what? <laughs> Fine. I was trying to. I was trying to get him with that one mud shot. We did the one mud shot there and it didn't it didn't quite do it. Hi. You're not you're not beating me, friend. <laughs> you're not beating me, GG's. Alright, wanna know in Ultra League. I sacrificed the poly. I was like, I, I I wanted to not show them just how badly they were hosed, but um they they didn't give me a choice. They didn't give me a choice, so we kind of ruined their day. Alright, Duke Saitama. Let's go. Let's go. What do you got for me? Polyrath versus Muck. Um We're generally favored here. We're generally favored here. The question is whether or not they'll shield. Um, I'm throwing the Ice Punch. I probably should just throw a straight Dynamic Punches. We have to be careful about a, like, a Gunk Shot. Actually, that's great for us. Like, a Gunk Shot hurts. I don't know that it kills us, though, and they're on Snarl. So, hit me with your best shot. All right, Sludge Wave. Yeah, that's fine. They still have to throw, like, another Sludge Wave to really do much to us. And I'm just not worried about the Snarl damage. We're already up a shield, which is pretty good. Um, my guess is that the Poly has work to do, but... I think we're gonna be okay. Like, I'm pretty sure this is gonna be a Dark Pulse. But let's just... The other thing is I don't really have... So what I'm gonna do here... We're up a shield here. That's... Oh, that's, that's terrible for us. <laughs> Good news is, we get this thing out, and we can, uh, you know, eliminate it with our Polyrath. The bad news is, is that our Articuno does nothing here. We just, we just let it go. It can't win this fight. <laughs> it can't win. I'm hoping we die here so we don't get farmed, but that's, that's gonna be a problem. I think we're just gonna get farmed. At least to the point where they're going to be able to, uh, you know, put some shield pressure on our Polyrath. Wham Bam, I see you. I'm just mostly ignoring you. <laughs> if you're going to bring in alts and call them your brother and sister, I'm going to mostly ignore you. But welcome to everyone from the Wham Bam family, if you, if you real. Oh, they actually threw the charge move. Oh, I was hoping they wouldn't throw the charge move so they accidentally die. You got me. You got me. Um, so my guess is they have charge moves here. So what I'm gonna do is, uh... Oh. Haunch Crow? I'm sorry, we getting Haunch Crowed here? We're getting Haunch Crowed here. Well, I'm pretty sure Haunch Crow dies to this gunk shot. Um, I will shield though. The whole fam, the full, whole fam's healed tonight. Hey, if if you want to make watching my stream a family gathering, I uh, am worried for your family, because we not we not family friendly. But we gunk shot that. This thing comes back. That's fine, right? We'll just we'll just soak up their energy here, and then we'll a little muck them out. Like I'm totally fine. I'm totally fine here. Like go go to town. They're trying to get uh, oh a muck right. It is oh it is muck. Yeah yeah we already we already saw the muck. Boop. You're not not gonna be able to snarl me down, friend. We manage our energy, we're nice and bulky. Holly Wrath, getting it done. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.
Man, Ultra League battles are so, they're so thick. Everything's so thick. I love it. Let's see, GFest wins. Do, 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 do. What did I miss? What did I miss? So we've got Wham Bam 2001 and 2002. I'm going to take a stab that those might be the years you were born in. Welcome to the stream. So G Fisk wins the mirror. Yeah. I don't I don't know. I I think the to me it sounds like main Fisk is better still because it's spammier. Like I just I I can't not use Mud Bomb if that's going to be an option. It just seems like seems like that would be very very good. It seems like that'd be exceptionally, exceptionally good. <laughs> Make sure I got that open. All right, let's go. Let's go. We're 2-0 in our first uh, Ultra League set. I like it. Rock Slide is hella spammy. You're, you're not wrong. I just don't think Rock Slide is all that well positioned in, in Great League meta right now. I'd much rather have Mud Bomb and a, uh, Electric Move. Alright, what do we got? Polyrath versus Swampert. We found ourselves another positive lead. Um, they... If they hit us with an Earthquake, that is relatively unfortunate. But, uh... You saw 12 crests? I've seen zero crests so far, so... Hopefully, that sticks. There we go. So, like, they can absolutely throw an Earthquake at me. My guess is because they didn't shield, they would prefer to throw the earthquake first come on nope they actually baited smart play by our opponent although the earthquake still doesn't kill us so the downside is that the earthquake puts us in range i think for hydro cannon to kill us right because it does a lot yeah so it's a little annoying but the upside is if they want to win switch advantage they're gonna need to start shielding. Oh, Charizard! Yo! Okay, Charizard's very good against our squad. Just as a just as an aside. Especially if it's on Air Slash. If this thing's on Air Slash, I don't know. Okay, it's on it's on Fire Spin. That's that's good. I don't know that we can beat an Air Slash Charizard. In fact, our best option against Charizard is this Polyrath that's mostly dead. So I'm just gonna do as much damage as I can. And hope that we get like a shield out of them, maybe? Come on, come on. Oh yeah, one HP. One HP, we get the uh the last ice punch. So we can at least try and uh oh they didn't. Yeah, alright. Alright. So they didn't even bother to bait yeah, okay. There's the blast burn. Now we just gotta really hope they don't get another blast burn. Okay, they did not. <laughs> I'm happy with that. Swampert comes back. That's fine. Yeah, we just have to take these. The question is... I don't know that I can get them all the way dead with quick moves here. But I'm gonna try. Like, because I just desperately want to Icy Wind, whatever comes in last twice. I think that's like, very good for us. Like, if we Icy Wind this Muck twice, I feel like we have a pretty good, actually I don't even think we need to do it twice. Just doing it once is fine. And we should have, cause that's gonna, that's gonna give us enough leeway here in the mirror, I think. To, to overcome the shield deficit. I think. I hope. That's kind of what I'm that's kind of what I'm working on is that like but I do have to put some pressure on them before they switch out. <laughs> I love I Articuno the only place Articuno is good is Ultra League. We have not also we've yet to see oh they didn't shield that. Jerk. Their best case scenario right now is uh they're basically hoping that they can swap out, but they're going to have to use the shield now. And, uh, I'm keeping an eye on the swap out timer because I think they're going to try and eat a charge move with the Swampert. So I'm not super inclined to throw a charge move yet. There it is. So we farm down the Swampert <laughs> and then we throw, then we throw the charge move. <laughs> Let's go. And nice and clean. Okay, 
Three and oh. Oh, I remember Ultra League. I remember Ultra League being a thing we were okay at. I've yet to see a crest. But I think that's that those might be micro metas too. Like I don't know where you're at on the uh on the scale, but maybe you're also higher up than me. But we've not seen a crest yet. Although I'm not really I've also not seen a Giratina yet. I've seen no Registeel, no Giratina, no Cresselia. None of those Pokemon have made an appearance yet. <laughs> not a single one. Not a single one. So I'll take it. I'm happy, like, I'll take all of those Pokemon, bring them on. Crest leads are annoying, that's like the one thing I don't want to see, but... I would use Hurricane and Articuno if I could, but I don't. Hey, W. Whitfield, this person's in one of my Lavender lobbies on Ghost Stadium. I'm their tournament manager. Also, they're using Ampharos. That is actually pretty good against us. I don't, I don't have an Ampharos counter. Um, just stay in here, please. Oh, okay, well, that's not what you want to be doing. This is definitely not what you want to be doing. Because that's not a good swap for you. <laughs> so we finally see a Giratina. Um, I mean, my guess is that what they want to do is just as much damage as they can. Because maybe they don't have a Muck counter. Like if they're on like Girati Ampharos, Giratina, and maybe like Venusaur. But this is real good for me. I just kind of need to keep the muck alive. Perfect. I wanted them to shield because I actually want to keep the muck alive. Like, very badly want to keep the muck alive because I need it to beat Ampharos. So we're definitely protecting muck. I didn't want to go, like, super shields down to protect muck because ultimately, like, that Ampharos is also going to have Thunder Punches and stuff ready to go, but I would like to... Do the best we can. So, like, is Ampharos coming back? If so, like, I feel like we actually need to protect the Muck still, which kind of sucks. <laughs> I don't really... Okay. You know what? Let's, uh... Togekiss is real good against us, as obviously is this Ampharos. So what am I supposed to do? <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> We don't have a good counter to any of the remaining Pokemon. I think the switch may have may have been bad. The switch may have been pretty bad for us. Uh, I was not expecting Togekiss in the back. Okay. So what are our options here? We we still have a shield. Yeah, I think I think we have to go this way. Like, I frankly think we actually have to do this. We're going to take one of these. Because this Pokemon is useless against Togekiss. Right? Absolutely garbage useless. So, eh. I kind of know what my outs are here. They're just very, very narrow. They're just very, very narrow. If I get a shield here, I have I have a plan. If I get a shield here, I do not. Oh, we don't have enough health. Ah. Hey, Jersey 2, how's it going? Yeah, we don't have enough health to work with. <sighs> yeah. Okay, fine. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean... I don't think Giratina is necessarily what you want to switch in, but that worked out for him. I mean, unfortunately, their team comp was really good against ours. I, I, the fact that they could essentially throw away their Giratina and both of their remaining two Pokemon broke up the remaining two we had is just not, not a thing we can beat. We can't beat that. That, te that team is, that team is too good against us, but also that team had an Ampharos on it. So it doesn't matter what it had hooked on Onyx, but yeah, I would imagine it had Focus Blast. I would think it had Focus Blast, but nothing to do about that. That team was very good against us, and there was... I don't know that we could have played that any any differently. Ah, Sceptile. All right, well, Sceptile is strong against us, but the upside is it's... We, like, a Grass Lead is something we are prepared for. Ooh, a Caesar. Well, technically, Ancient Power is the play here. 
So I'm going to throw these. Just straight ancient powers. Maybe we get a boost. But we're going to lose this. We're going to probably lose this fight. So I'd rather just do as much damage as possible as opposed to giving a shit about that. Although I think uh, they might be experiencing some lag. They might be experiencing... Oh, there's the boost. Oh. Well, we got a boost. <laughs> but I believe our opponent may have lagged out. So I'm going to give him a sec to hopefully get in here. Boosts in chat, at least. Boosts in chat, at least. Also, I like that the, the Caesar just does, like... It does, like, a little wave thing every once in a while. It just does a little wave thing. But yeah, we'll, we'll give him a sec to hopefully come back into the game. Like... Obviously, I'm pretty, I mean, not happy that they lagged out, but he, I got, I boosted so hard he lagged out. <laughs> that is possible. That is possible. I mean, might as well give him a chance to get back in the game. I don't know that I'm the kindest player I ha ever hooked on Onyx, but I like to give people a chance to come back. I know that generally, like, you know, the, the, the route for them is to restart the game. So if they restart the game, and uh, they get back in, awesome. If, you know, I'll give them usually a little bit and then I unfortunately just, I, I can't wait forever, but I do at least try and, and give them an opportunity to come back, but it's starting to look like they're probably not gonna come back at this point, so. But I do like, yeah, Caesar's little like, little thing there is pretty, is pretty great. It's pretty great. All right, well let's maybe, again, like we can try and trigger that. I mean, at some point, we're just going to take our free win. GBL giveth and taketh away. I'm not going to, like, I've had some people be like, well, why don't you just quit? I'm like, well, because, one, my opponent probably would not extend me the same the same honor. And two, because we might have won this. <laughs> I'm not going to forfeit if GBL, if GBL, you know, totally craps out on my opponent. That seems, there's a level of honor that I have, and it's not quite that one. They won't be back. <laughs> you might be. You might be right, Rivera. But we tried. Um, I think we. I think we actually would have won this too. Um, with that boot. There they are. They're back. Oh, they did make it back. I guess I should. Oh, I actually did give them enough time to get back. But all right. I feel bad. I feel bad that they. Uh, they're probably quitting at this point. Yeah. I mean, I tried to get them back. I waited, I waited like the full sort of like, you know, minute, minute and a half. I, I feel bad. I, I'm not letting my opponent win. <laughs> I know, I think we would have just timed out, right? We could have just waited that clock out and time out, but you know, I'm just trying, I'm trying my best. I'm trying my best to, to, to be polite when I notice, you know, my opponent lagging out essentially and just see if we can get a, a relatively fair game. 